there is a saying that change is the only thing permanent in the life. Everything changes with the time. And same way, I decided to change my trading setup after four years. Last I designed my trading setup was in year 2020. Now after four years, in 2024, I have redesigned my trading setup. So in this video, I'm going to take you through the tour of my trading room. And in this video, I'm going to show you how I change my trading setup from this to this. And this is the 360 degree view of my trading room. Let me now take you to the each corner to show you what all the new things I have added to my trading room. And the first thing you can see that entire room, I changed the wall color. Earlier it was a blue color and now I change it to beige color because this will give you calmness and freshness during the trading hours. And the next change you can see that Earlier I did not have any bed in this room, I had only sofa come bed but this time I have decided to add one single bed so that whenever I am tired I can come and lie down here. And white is my favorite color so that is why I always prefer to have my bed covered with white bed sheet and white comforter. And now to enhance the bedside look I have added a side lamp as well as a bamboo tree. So this lamp costed me around 7000 and this bamboo tree around 6000. And the next one I was wondering what should be go behind the bed on the wall. Initially I was thinking that I'll go for a wall painting or a wall decor or something like that. And then I thought it has become old fashioned. So that is why behind my wall I have got fixed the wall panels. This is called the wall panels which also called as lowers. So which gives very good aesthetic looks. I got this on the both side on this side and this side and it costed me almost like close to 50,000 and then above the panel let me add the shelf so that I can keep some show pieces as well as some books and these are some books which I have had to complete and to name a few and this is the book by Linda Goodman which I am currently reading and this is astrology related book and I am sure many of you may not be aware that I am a strong believer in astrology and I know astrology I know how to read horoscope, though I have not discussed anywhere earlier, I know that many people don't believe in astrology, but I am telling with my experience, astrology is a divine science, there can be fraud astrologer, but astrology is not a fraud, astrology is a divine science, so don't be surprised after a couple of years, if I start a new YouTube channel and teaching astrology. And the next edition you can see here that I have got a two seater sofa here, it looks very cute and very comfortable to sit. So whenever I'm tired sitting on the computer chair, I come here and I sit here and I start trading. So this is the two seater sofa and I think I paid total 29,000. And the next now, just above this sofa, you can see that there is a big bull poster. So anybody comes to my room, first thing they will see this poster and they will know that I'm into stock market. And now next you can see that there is a side lamp and this lamp is something I spent almost two to three days in finding the right lamp. So curved is something you will not get so much option even on online. That's why I had to search a lot, visiting almost 15 to 20 light shops and finally I got this exactly how I wanted. And this kind of lamps are very expensive. This is known as curved lamp or arc lamp and I got it for almost 15,000. And the next one you can see that I have got a white curtain here. Earlier if you remember I had a brown color blind i changed from blind to white curtain and as i said earlier white is my favorite color and this is the view from my room and now next comes my workspace the first thing you can see that earlier i had a very good computer desk which almost six feet wide but over the period of time i realized that i don't need such a big computer desk because it was taking too much space so I got my carpenter and I asked him to shorten the width and he cut into half and now I have almost three feet wide of this computer desk and now it can easily accommodate two monitors and laptop and I can do the same work and though the computer table is the old but computer chair is not the old. This is the new computer chair earlier what I had was very big size 
and it was not going well with the small room i changed it to this chair which i bought it from the home center it may look like very economical chair but it is not i paid almost 18000 for this chair because i wanted the exact color and with the exact size as well as this has got a very good cushion so you feel comfortable while doing the work and next one is my gadgets and totally i used two monitors and two laptop one is macbook pro and another one is hp laptop which i was using earlier but sometime back i stopped using hp and now i am using only this macbook pro this macbook pro actually i purchased it in year 2020 and i paid almost 2 lakh rupees for this macbook pro but the thing is that i was not using it because i was more comfortable using the hp laptop but around 6 to 8 months back there was some problem with my hp laptop and i was forced to use this macbook pro and somehow after using for few days i became so comfortable using the macbook pro that after that now even though hp laptop is working i am not using it i am only using the this macbook pro and that is the beauty of apple products because initially you may find some difficulty but once you start using it then you will not use anything i made a partition so that mean now i can use this as a mac operating system as well as windows operating system earlier i was not comfortable using this magic mouse and i was using this logitech the big one because i thought this is more comfortable but what happened that after using some time i started getting hand pain because of too big size then i started using magic mouse and now i'm so comfortable using this magic mouse that after that i purchased one more so now i have two magic mouse one is black color and one is white color and then this is the keypad for my monitor and then i have calculator and some show pieces here post it notes here and this is the clock unfortunately this clock is not working this i purchased from the bombay store and from day one only it was not working now time is showing around 7:45 but actually time is now around 10:30 and then this ganesha and this bull and then i have two monitors and both these monitors are connected with this cpu and what is the configuration how i connected what all the software hardware everything already i made a video on this if you go to my old videos you can see that i have made a video called my trading setup from there you will get all the details if you want to know what is the configuration of this trading setup okay now i'll show you how i am taking the use of this two monitors you can see that if i have only one monitor and if i want to trade in nifty or bank nifty currently i am recording in the live market you can see that i have a bank nifty chart here 5 minutes chart and 1 minute chart and also here i have nifty 5 minutes and 1 minute chart and if i want to see the both at the same time then every time i have to go and click on different window right but same time i have two monitors so what i can do is i can just drag it and i can leave it on another monitor and now you can see that i have on one screen i have nifty chart here and on my another monitor i have bank nifty chart here so that is the advantage of having the two screens since you can have a look at the both nifty bank nifty at the same time so this is how i take a use of two monitors and for placing the order normally i use my laptop or my mobile and now these are the some show pieces and some trading related books and on the corner you can see that i have some hanging lights and it looks very nice on the corner which i paid i think around 700 or 800 rupees then i have my youtube button which i got it after achieving 1 lakh subscribers then i have some show piece and this is one of my favorite feature i feel very proud when i look at it many people may think that it's a show off but it's not a show off because when i was in school i did not have even a cycle at home and i had to walk down to my school every day morning and evening and all of my friends had the cycle and when i started my career in my first job as a medical rep i could not even afford a second hand scooty i wanted 10000 rupees but i did not have that so first 10 months i had to depend on public transport and finally after 10 months somehow i got 10000 rupees loan and i purchased the second hand kinetic honda so once upon a time i did not have money to buy even a second hand scooty and few years down the line now i could afford two brand new luxury cars that is mercedes and audi and that also without taking a single rupee car loan so that mean once upon a time i did not have 10000 rupees to buy a second hand scooty 
and today i could purchase two luxury cars that also without taking any loan so that is what this is for motivation for others also today you may not be having anything but time will not remain same time will change but you have to dream big and you have to work hard and now next comes some trading related books and the books really which help me in my trading journey and i would say if you are very new to trading then i would highly recommend this book called technical analysis explained by martin prink so this you can say bible for a new trader somebody who doesn't have any experience about technical analysis and if you are already experienced if you are a fan of pivot points price action cpr then this is the book which i highly recommend that is the secret of pivot boss by frank ochoa this is the book from where i learned everything about the pivot points and cpr next one is this this is you can say lighter version of secret of pivot boss this written by late ashwini gujral that is how to make money in intraday trading this also one of my favorite books and if you are struggling from trading psychology then this book i highly recommend that is the trading in the zone written by mark douglas this is also one of the very good books to improve your trading psychology and even you can read this book that is also written by mark douglas that is the discipline trader and then somebody who is very experienced but still they are seeing that they are not able to improve their trading success then i would suggest read this book that is a market wizards interview with top traders so what you will learn after reading this trading is not only about strategy but trading is more about risk management and trading psychology because all traders have different strategies but all these are successful traders who have given interviews that's what you see that you can have any strategies but having a right trading psychology risk management can help you to become a good trader and then somebody who wants to learn more about the swing trading advanced kind of book and especially people who want to trade in stocks this is the book known as trade like a stock market wizard so this is also one of the best books and finally you can see that i have one basic books on future option many of you must be wondering that why i have this book because nowadays if you want to learn future and option basics you have everything on google youtube everything right then why i have this book and the reason is this is the first book which i have read from ashwini gujral on learning future and option way back in 2009 so that means almost 15 years back and what is buying option selling option call option put option everything explained very detailed way that time there was no much information on youtube and google and this is the book which helped me to learn future and option so this may be outdated now because everything is available online but as a gratitude and tribute to ashwini gujral who passed away recently i am keeping this book in my bookshelf and finally i have this tv set and above the tv you can see that there is a shelf and i kept some cane basket there and inside i kept all the charger and all other stuffs i don't use much of the tv during the market hours because what happens is normally when you look at the tv and suppose you have taken a long trade in nifty or bank nifty and some analyst comes and says that nifty bank nifty looking bearish then you get confused whether you have to stay with the long trade or you have to go for a short trade so your bias changes so that is why it's always to do your own analysis only i watch it whenever there is some event like rbi event budget policy or election result which can affect the market during that time only i watch it otherwise normally i watch it only during the cricket match okay guys that's about the small video on my tour of my trading room and you must be wondering that who is the interior designer for this room and that interior designer is me i not consulted any interior designer i only personally designed my room after doing some research online and then i got all my labels like carpenters painters everybody and then that is how i designed my room and while selecting the each item for the room i have ensured that i will not think about saving the money i will not try to cut the corners and all this i have chosen the best one even though expensive because i wanted the best for my trading room so that while trading i can feel good inside my trading room and i can trade peacefully i am sure many of you got lot of ideas how you can plan your trading room and also let me know in the comment section what did you like about this trading room and also if you have any suggestion then feel free to give your suggestion in the comment section 
and that's it guys from my side and i'll continue with my regular educational youtube videos until then bye and take care